level of fit when your partner overcalls. First of all, what is the level of fit? Well, it's a clever theory which gives you a guide to the level that you should bid to when you have a fit with your partner. A fit, of course, is eight or more cards between you in a suit. And this applies particularly in a competitive auction. A competitive auction is an auction where both sides are actively bidding. For example, if the opponents open a heart and your partner overcalls a spade, the responder supports with two hearts, and then you come in with two spades, this is a competitive auction. So when you are in a competitive auction and have a known fit with your partner, bidding to the level of fit is a very powerful tool, especially when your hand is weak. Say the opponents open a heart, your partner overcalls a spade, and then the responder bids two hearts, what should you bid next? First question, do we have a fit? So between your partner and you, do you have a known eight card or more fit? The second question is, are you weak? Is your hand weak? And a weak hand in this kind of context means between zero and nine points. If you answer yes to these questions, then you should bid to the level of fit. This means bid for as many tricks as your side has in trumps. Here are some examples to demonstrate. In this first hand, the opponent has opened a heart, your partner has overcalled a spade, and you're a weak hand, you have between zero and nine points, and you know that you have a fit. You've got three cards, your partner has shown at least five, so you know that with your three cards, you have at least eight cards between you. You should now bid to the level of fit. You have three, three plus five is eight, and eight trumps is eight tricks, so bid two spades. In this next example, you also know that you have a fit. You've now got four in your partner's suit. Four plus five is nine, Nine is the equivalent of the three level, so you bid three spades. In the last example, you have five spades. Five plus at least five from your partner gives you a minimum of ten between you, so when you jump to the level of fit, you jump to four. The big point to make here is don't tiptoe round. Just jump straight to the level of fit. This probably is going to make you a little bit nervous at first. It will feel very risky and you'll probably have your heart racing, but just have faith. Bridge enthusiasts have spent hours researching the validity of this concept and agree that it is a usually an excellent strategy and surprisingly accurate. The idea is that if you make your contract, then that's great. But if you go down, it could still be great. And this is because it could be a better result for you, because the opponents could probably have made their contract. You will usually go down for fewer points than the opponents will make. In summary, if your partner overcalls, bid to the level of fit where you have a fit with your partner and you are weak. Most importantly, have fun. Successfully stealing the contract from the opponents is one of the most joyous things you can do in bridge. Songs, party on, excellent